Welcome to the ice caves of Dark and Darker. I'm scared, Spud. <laughs> Here, you'll find players going toe to toe in 2v2 combat over the coveted gold pile. One of the most lucrative sources of pure juice in the game. It goes without saying, as a result, the map is infested with rogue mains. The lights off, yeah. <gasps> behind me, dude! Rogue behind me, please help! Coming, coming! Hit him, nice. yes, bro! That was like the Matrix! Thank you so much! <laughs> so much is like the Matrix! <laughs> Thank you! Wherever you go, there's something in the trees. Regulars of the channel already know I can be a little bit childish at times. Hiya! Somebody! I'm a Oh, yes, the song of my people. It's the inner clown in me. I grew up on the likes of South Park and Ren and Stimpy. So, of course, I needed a friend like Maddo to compliment me. You perverts in chat. You ready for this? Oh, he's cranking one out. <laughs> Came for the toe. All right, sorry about that, guys. We're a little bit childish. Ladies and gentlemen, the dungeon is stressful, okay? Maddo was well-versed in the brutal invasion of the OCE servers from the country of unknown origins. Oh, no. And their RMT gold farmer groups. Ah, uh, no, 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 uh, Nihama, uh, uh, friendly. What's that little thing to me? <laughs> God damn, you blew my cover. I was trying to be convincing. Even with his past experience in previous games, it can be easy to slip up and lose the trust of the RM teamers when you attempt to befriend them. Hey, you and then bamboozle them. Friend? Yeah, we yeah, friend. friend. Me and you, friend. Best friend. Yeah. Yeah. Where are you from? Where are you from? I'm from America. America. Where are you Where from? Are you from? Uh, Yankee. 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 Bing Chiling. Boshala, Bing Chiling. Shady Wei Young? Shinji? Shady Wei Young, Shinji! Oh, these guys are actually shit. Most of my games since the wipe have been with either two of my mates, Geef. I was just throwing anchors at him, and then, uh, yeah, you know. Or Maddo. I've actually got a 40 damage, yeah. bro. It's actually really overpowered <laughs> right now. <laughs> ah, shit, it's a cobalt, you can't. He's not one, he's not one. Not, he's not, shit. Yeah. I got him, you take. Oh, red armor, yes. And both of them liked melee-based classes, so the partnership worked a treat with my wizard as a backline support in the fights. Plus back, ooh, plus back, rotate. Do you think? Oh, he's so f dude. No, no, I hit him because of Freddy. No, he's like actually. Oh yeah. Like. You dead there, yeah? Like a really dark grim movie. F Get out of here, dude. Get in this room and close the door. God, it's oh, it's My main build focused around the Overload perk, a new perk that doubles your spells for the wizard. I stack knowledge points to give me more spell casting speed and memory capacity to use all of the spells to my advantage as the overload perk nerfs your memory, making the build very 
gear dependent. Wherever I could, I stacked flat damage on top of that, and vigor for health points to take an extra arrow or two in fights. Wizard is really fun right now, maybe because the overload perk made the class actually playable for PvE and PvP. You know, instead of having to use two, three spells to kill one goblin and then sit on the floor for half an hour. I'm so sorry for sitting on the floor half the game. It's just peak wizard gameplay. Alright, you can actually clear a room with your spells now. And if a player wants to ruin your day, you have some spells left over to ruin his arsehole with instead. Are they both together? Yeah, yeah. Okay. They're trying to throw towards it. Yep. Wizards. Well, I uh, yep. Yeah. I've hit him once, go for him. Hit him twice. Yeah, he's hurting. He's hurting. Get this guy. Nice dude. Pass back if you need. Pass back. The Wendigo, at first, requires some cheese. And is up there with the Jaws movie when it comes to moments of horror in the game. Oh, he's angry. He's moving real fast. Yeah, he can catch you <laughs> quick. Well, once you learn this one-step cheese, you find out it's just a man in a suit and it's no longer very scary. This is the strat to kill on the Wendigo. Show you. Don't tell the devs. Now, if you're watching and you're going to call out the wizard as OP. Bro, fucking bullshit fucking wizard OP, bro. I got I got I got five tapped, bro. I, I did I just walked in a straight line. I got I got killed, bro. I got killed, bro. Then let me show you vampiric spells on the warlock. Uh, Harry, Harry, it's okay. It, it's okay. I, I'm not saying nerf the warlock or, you know, that they have to fine-tune him on the, the high end of damage or whatever. Like, I, I learned, Harry, I learned from the PDR fighter video and the invis 2 tap ambush sack tap rogue video that people identify with their class that they play. And, you know, it's it's, it's like borderline real-life politics where, you know, people will start a holy war and shit on my lawn even if I slightly constructively break down what's going on right or wrong with the class, even with receipts. Like, I, you know, I know. Harry, Harry I know. It's fine. I, I, it's all good. I got this. All right. I'll just show this clip instead and let the commenters tell me what I did wrong in the comments after the 2v1 situation with the warlock. This is fine. All right. Uh, can go through. I got rid of it. Just plus back, dude. Don't die on me. Curse got me, bro. Curse got me. Nothing I could do. Dude, this is fucking AIDS, man. How, how are they that fucking strong, dude? How is it that strong? How is it like just two casts and you're instantly dead? From a dot. Yeah, just constantly spawning Hydra in front of the doorways. And That's no, the Hydra's fine. It's the literally like I'm instantly dead off of one cast. Like, at least with Zap, I have to shoot him like three times and aim. Like, just one cast on me, and that's it. I'm out of the fucking game. Yeah, the dot's too much, bro. No wonder he's so confident. He's just, eh, fuck it, I can do what I want. Hmm. Hit him? Yep. One's on the right, one's on the yeah, left. They're, they're baiting Bok, baiting Bok. He's right yep. around the corner with it. Yep. Right to the left. Yep. One. Hit him. Yep. I'm good. I'm running away from the BOC. Yeah. Both of them are BOC, but they'll run out. I hit him on the right. He could be weak. Push the guy on the right. We just double team him. He's got no B. He's got no phantomize. He can't win this. I'll go left. He's hit. Yeah, nice, nice phantomize. Oh, on me, on me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit him. Nice. 
Fuck yeah! Well done. I'll be honest with you guys. It's still one of my favorite things to do in the game. Ah, uh, they went for where? I was going anyway. Keep. Oh no! I wish I was recording! No! Stop. And that's spectate other players. He didn't leave the body yet. He's gonna fight. He's gonna like. Interesting. We won't know because of the, because of the uh, the timer. I can't keep specking. But the look up and the double take. <laughs> he is. His ass is so prolapsed. We don't even need to see that. That's like the drama. Exactly. We don't need to see the conclusion. We know how that plays out. Oh, hello there. I thought I would just remind you guys watching that I also live stream on twitch.tv, mostly dark and darker, but sometimes other video games. There'll be dick jokes and a lot of fart jokes. I'm very childish like that. So if you'd like to finger blast all the buttons and, you know, click the little love heart that's somewhere up here in the top right of the screen, you can follow this channel too and be a true spotty buddy. Thanks. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be three, two, one, go. Okay. Okay. Go. And you throw your fireball on go. Three. Or you just two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. you, you have to have pace, bro. You, you can't just go three, two, one, go. <laughs> no, you know. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Remember, it's steady pace, three, two, one, go. Okay? You do like, the count. That's better. I'm going to do the count, okay? Three, two, one, go. What was that, mate? Dude, you're burning. <laughs> a Discord delay, I swear. It, it takes, it, there's like a bit of, I'm not me, I'm not actually pranking you, I swear. There's literally like a, I, I forget what the fight. You got to remember, there's like an animation we've got to account for. I didn't. Can I triple shot jump you? Hold on, hold on, no, 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 no. We've got it, hold on. You've got this, bro. I'm starting to believe. <laughs> nah, this is not gonna work, dude. This is, this is stupid. This is stupid. Let's just fucking go. Let's just do oh, something. Shit. Oh, I'm crying, bro. Uh. Oh, that hurts. Why I found myself playing the duo map with my friends, Geef and Maddo. It's like you're playing Dead by Daylight. Bloody hell. <laughs> Drop a pallet. I've dropped a pallet in my pants, all right? Is because Goblin Cave's the solo map is absolute balls. At least for High Roller. It's so balls, I'd rather play the duo map and 1v2 as a solo than actually play the Goblin Caves. In fact, I'd rather take a cheese grater to my nuts, honestly. Oh, God! He knew it was over. I'm not jerking myself off, but you know how like I was shooting just a little bit in front of him to hop him? I was getting him away from the door. The zone moves too fast and the map favors classes like the Warlock, Fighter, Barbarian over so many others. They just land on you, like around corners. Like it just, there's not a lot to work with space-wise and you struggle to keep distance. Hey, and like, I'm not the only one that feels like this, right? I, I sift through live streams of the game now and then and I notice lads like Bold Dizzle echoing the same feelings. It's, it's very, very, it's very, very overcrowded in terms of PVP, dude. It's just players, bro. It's just players and players and players. Like, I, I don't get a chance to do any looting, bro. I said it at the start. I'm not sure if you're watching the start of this match. I said I got hit by a, an archer and I was like, I bet you it's going to be 10 seconds, 30 seconds. There's enough. No, the wizard found me, bro. He's waiting for me, bro. What the f can I do against that? Ultimately, after playing the Ice Caverns in depth now, it's clear to me that one and a half years of player data and the devs knowing what their game is, they designed a true map for the game. And Goblin Caves, and even to an extent the other maps, are kind of a misrepresentation of the game's potential. Definitely Goblin Caves. New players install the game and they play a solo match of the Omaha Beach landing scene in that map. Oh. 
and that's what they think represents the whole game. I understand the normal mode feels like a quick and fun battle royale, and some people enjoy that, and that's fine, but the HR version of it is just, it just feels lame. And, you know, I'm, I'm hoping one day they find a way to make new maps for the solo queue, or at least redesign the goblin caves, or after they've redesigned maps, bringing back rotations. Because I would have quit the game if it wasn't for Ice Caverns, and the duo queue, like, no joke. I, I'm not even being facetious. I mean, if you don't use it, I'll grab it. No, I'm not using it until yours, mate. All right, cheers. You know what? I got a present for you. Really? You've been so good to me tonight. I want you to have this. Monkey. It's oh, it's for you. I actually will use that because my current one is plus two and one resourcefulness and dex is better. So, thank Wait, you. Wait, you've already got a plus two one? I do. Do you want this one? This has got resourceful. I do have a plus two. Yeah. I just wanted a dex is better than resourceful, so yeah, absolutely. I think we're about to have sex. <laughs> You're about to. There's about to be penetration. <laughs> you won't. You won't see it. But you will hear it. Hear it. <laughs> <laughs> we're literally laughing like we're in a relationship. Right? It's getting cringe. <laughs> 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 I just need to do that and fucking quit my head back. This map and duo mode is what I feel subjectively is the true dark and darker experience. PVE is more interesting. The map's more interesting. And look, if you go play the trio mode, you know, the full party mode in the game, it's basically buff ball meta. And you either live by it or die by it. In duos, it feels like there's so many builds and class partnerships that are viable and work together well. Uh, I'm hasting you. Let's fuck up. Oh, what the f am I doing? You Sorry, piggy. Sorry. Go. So no, what? nothing no, weird. No, goes. no, I'm going away. Yeah, yeah, go, go. I mean, go that way. Go away. Dude, it's the exact. Uh, shut up, boys and girls. All right. I f***ed up. Why? All right. <laughs> well, at least we know the damage is good on the, um, I went to haste him. Look, look, the icons look the same. I should make it like pink or something. Something that's not the same color. Realistically though, realistically. What? Why were you hasting me? What was this? Like, like you know when you like, uh, I don't know, like you know when like Legolas throws in Gimli into the fight in Lord of the Rings. Legolas, Legolas doesn't do that. Aragorn Who? does that. Aragorn, my bad. Yeah, like that. Why, my, my lord, of the rings. <laughs> lord of the rings. <laughs> I definitely, uh, definitely gave you a ring of fire. All right. One second. Actually, in Steam 52, it was Aragorn that you give me, not Legolas, so you're not actually a real Lord of the Rings fan like me, sorry. Now, on a final note regarding the Goblin Caves, maybe a PvE only map for new players might help them learn the game. You know, where you only gain a very small amount of loot at the end of the match, so small it's not even possible to cheese or gold farm. You can't gain any more momentum than, you know, if you were grinding normals. Definitely not HR. But, you know, something for the players that really struggle to learn the game because there's no tutorial right now, which I hope makes it into the game before an Epic or Steam Store push happens because most new players need their hand held at the beginning of their experience. It's why why single player games have opening chapters designed as intuitive tutorials to ease them into the mechanics of the game. I mean, Escape from Tarkov mains get filtered in this game, and that's allegedly one of the hardest games out there. So what hope does this game have with future new players if professional gamers like this man can't handle this game? Please don't let me die the bats right here, Hudge. Please. Please. Die. Die. Die! Die! Please! Oh my god. There's no, there's no healing totems down here? Anyway, that last little rant, that was just food for four, you know, for the community and the developers. I love this game and I want it to stick around for years to come. I don't want it to be tumbleweed or a dead game with like, you know, 500 players worldwide. You know, like you, you got to bring people into the experience somehow. Them trying to like go out of their way and Google 1700 different YouTube videos to get little tidbits of information here and there. Just not many people are as astute as you think. Yeah.
Maybe I'm a cynical man. Maybe I'm just dead inside. As long as Dark and Darker doesn't go dead. That was the main point I was trying to get across, you know. I just, I just don't want the game to be a dead game in the future if, you know, they actually get it on Epic or Steam soon TM. Teach new players how to play the game. He's just resting with his girlfriend. <laughs> He's weirdo. I can't believe that's the first thing you thought of, you fucking degenerate. Go on, get up. Let's go. We're gonna, we're gonna leave your girlfriend behind. Alrighty. Let's go. Look, AI is getting good, but not that good, alright? I'm gonna bounce him out. He's yeah. bouncing? Yep. Direct him, he's dead. Barbarian? Yes, yes, hit him. You Push lead, him. you lead. Nice. Back, 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 trust. He's panicked there, we got him. Well done, dude. Huge. It's just peak wizard gameplay.